You want to do it How can all the pressure be on right. Dallas if they well, got to win tonight? Well, listen, the pressure's on Dallas. You know, they, they, they got a slim slither of hope now, Dallas. And so they're like, before it was like they had nothing to lose in game four. They were like, we're down three or nothing to lose. Now they feel like they can get back in the series. So there's a little more pressure on them to, to push it back to their home court. So I just think it's a 10 for Boston. I think they got to get the job done here on their home court. You don't want to give them any hope because now the momentum shifts to Dallas if the Celtics lose on their home court. So now two things happen. Dallas believes they can beat you in their home court. And Dallas has shown they can beat you in a dominant fashion on their home court. So it's a must win for the Celtics. They, right now, you don't want to have to take that flight. Like I said, uh, that flight, it it'll be brutal. Mm. It'll be the brutal three-hour flight to Dallas. I mean, and for one, I already got my, my duck boat reservations still for this week. I don't want to have to push this back. Mm. You know, I got the, the parade. I got, I got, the, I got my, my booth at the club party, the championship <laughs> party. I got my bottles lined up. Skip. Yeah. I got. I mean, because oh, you know, I know Luca watched Undisputed last week. I believe he did. He watched Undisputed yeah. last week. That's yeah. why they came in and, and got that game Friday. So. But yet he's watching again, and you are no, guaranteeing no, no, but he, a Celtics victory tonight. And I know he's gonna come in with a Jordan mentality. That's why I don't mind. He can go out and get forty, but we got to stop these other guys. So mm. don't mess my. I can't have my reservations messed up. You know, <laughs> I'm gonna be at the Encore. I got my duck boat. I got it all lined up. Mm. So this is a ten on the on the Richter scale mm. that we they get it done. The confetti is is, is hanging in the Raptors. It's, it's in the nets. It's in the nets, ready to get dropped. Mm. The commissioner, the trophy, the ball, everything is lined up. Mm. We don't want to have to travel with this. Mm. We don't want to pack this up and travel with it to Dallas. Are, are you sure you're not going to wind up on tugboats instead of tugboats? Tugboats. <laughs> tugboats. Yeah. <laughs> Tugging along? <laughs> no, these are duck boats. Yeah. Skip. Okay. These are duck boats. We can ride. We can ride these on land and water. Yep. You know, I've been being able to understand basketball for, I don't know, Skip, and since I was probably seven, eight years old, really understand it and watch championships, whether it was Boston, Lakers, Philly, who, Chicago, you know, whatever, whatever those games are. This is probably, no, there is no probably, it is the biggest game in Boston Celtics championship run history for me. This is, and here's why I say that, say this. Based on the history of well, this wasn't, group... It wasn't when we beat y'all Lakers, it wasn't I'm that the, one? <laughs> Be I'm just, quiet. I'm just, I'm just saying, it, it, it wasn't when we beat Lakers. No, no, I'm okay. talking about this game, this one game. You said since seven, but you was alive in 2008. No, no, but that, uh, here's why, I'm gonna get there. Right. Because the history has shown me with this particular core group of players mm -hmm. that they fold their tents. That is true. That's why. That has been Y'all didn't fold y'all team. Y'all was going up against Shaqs and it was different, man. Kobe and them. That's a, different than this Celtic, I mean, this Mavs team. Y'all have shown the blow leads, not only blow leads, let teams back in late in the fourth quarter, get let Miami Heats, that's the ninth seeds, 12 seeds, whatever you want to call it, beat y'all. Yeah. You, you, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. On they top didn't of go up against Shaqs, but no, no, no. Yeah. no, no I'm, yeah, no, y'all played. No, no, no. Play Kobe. Oh, it was Powell. Kobe that's right. Powell. It was yeah. Kobe and Powell. My bad. But, but Kobe's enough. It's just yeah, Kobe's Kobe. enough. Yeah. <laughs> it, it, when you when you look at it and you talk about how they got here, right? Yeah. They played against a team in Miami that was a team with jerseys on. They also played against another team that had jerseys on in Indy. So you start to look at that and you go, man, they play against a Cleveland team that had jerseys on. There was really nothing I, I that, like that they, they just feared. Had jerseys they on. just had jerseys yeah, on. There was like nothing that. for them to fear. It was nothing for y'all to fear. <laughs> it was nothing for y'all to fear. <laughs> y'all basically <laughs> broke out the broom to get to the championship. Well, so now man, you're looking crazy. at this and yeah. you mess around and you lose this game, <laughs> the ghost of the past starts to creep in, the doubt. Are we good enough to finish this deal? All of those sort of things. You talked about it, Paul. It's a must win, and you don't want to fly all the way back to Dallas on a three-hour flight that seems like you're getting ready to go to Africa or something on a plane because oh, it's going to be long and, and the turbulence and it just, your brain is just quiet. 
the lights off, no one wants to eat, they just stay sick to their stomach. And then you're going into an a atmosphere that just popped you by 38. Mm. So to me, in, 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 the, in the short time that I've watched this team play, this is a must win, man. You gotta win this. Because mm. if you don't win this, it's over. I'm, I'm over there with Skip. I'm not messing with you no more, Paul. You go 3 2. I'm going with Skip. I'm so if we lose 3 2, yo, it's over. Up, it's, it's over. over. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta get in. So you saying. I'm getting off the so, boat because I can't swim anyway, so I gotta have a, a life jacket so, on. So <laughs> don't be laughing, saying, Skip. So, so what you're saying is it's gonna be 156 and 1. If y'all lose this one, it probably we lose this game. So mm -hmm. that means, yeah. So mm -hmm. that means a team, yes, that has that's lost what it means. Three in a row games. That's what it means. All year is not only gonna lose three in a row, but they guess gonna lose what? Four in a row. We talking about all year in the regular season. You would not face this same type of obstacles. You have not had this type of pressure. So losing about... two games in the regular season or losing three games, even four games or five games in the regular season is not the same as losing two in a championship. No, it don't matter. But you build ha habits. You built these habits yes, correct. during the regular season. And guess what your habits are? That, that we don't known, lose back-to-back -back games But you've that been much. known to choke. You said it earlier, Key, when they lost those back-to-back -back games, it wasn't a way home situation. I understand it, but it's also the, the regular game, season. It's not yeah. the playoffs. Y'all okay. choke in the playoffs. Y'all have choked. Put it that way. Y'all choked. About, you're talking about the past. What? And that's why I say ghosts start creeping shit. back in. You start saying, damn, man, here we go all over again. Mm. Here we go again. It's like the, the, the yips that kickers get. Yep. They kick it. It's like, well, he, he missed. Then he go back out there again. He missed. Then you put him even closer, skip to the 30. He missed. <laughs> then you say, well, you know what? We're going for two. We're not dealing with this anymore. Once they go south, you Once they can't go get south, them back. Can't get them back. That's how I feel. Y'all better win this game, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> Paul Pierce. Hey, man, don't text me. I'm, I'm blocking hey. you tonight. I don't want to hear nothing. <laughs> he, he gonna I'm going to be sitting right next to you. I'm coming to the house. I'm going to be sitting right there. Paul, all I know is you are getting pounded on the backboards. All right, what that mean? You are What's getting... Our, all right, so tell me that. What's our record when they beat us on the boards in this series? What's our record? When they beat you when on the boards? When they win the rebound the war... Series? Two and one. We're two and one. Okay. All right. They beat us three times. We won two of those. That's Similarly, not an indicator, you, Skip. You are getting that's that not right. an indicator. Okay, so Give me Pat Riley else. was wrong about no Yeah, that's the 80s. Talking that's talking about the 80s. 80s. <laughs> <laughs> Give me something else. Give me something else. 30 you, years ago. You, you were getting <laughs> annihilated points in the paint. Annihilated. Okay, it's a three-point shooting league, you, Skip. You, you're Who's down, winning the three-point war? You're down 66 Who's points. Who's winning the three-point war, okay. Skip? This is a three-point game. Give me something else, Skip. You got to give me something else. What about, all right, free throw disparity. All right. You got to come up with something I'm going to give you this. <laughs> Luka Doncic is a bad you know yeah, what. Yeah, he is. He I is. I couldn't agree more. And he disappointed me royally in game two because they had you on the ropes in the on fourth the quarter. Yes, they oh, did. Was that 21 points No, not point. in game two. Was that and Luka in the fourth points? quarter. Oh, all game two, game yeah, two. Yeah, game two. Luka goes one of six and missed both of his threes and had two horrendous, just frustrated turnovers mm -hmm. that were quick runouts for easy basket for you. You can't do that, and I don't think you're going to get that Luca tonight. I think you're going to get Road Warrior Luca tonight. What's Luca tonight. giving you? What's Luca's? How about this one? I yeah. want you to pull this up mm -hmm. before the end of the show. What's Luca averaging versus the Celtics just in the second half? Well, what's the shoot percentage? Because I know he do all this damage in the first half, mm -hmm. and then somehow in the second half, well, I know the other he night. Just... He was only two for eight in the second half because yep. he didn't contribute much at all. And he was just one for six the last game before that. And I guarantee... <laughs> okay. <laughs> if, they, if they not up at the half, if Dallas is not up at the half, right. don't count on Luka maybe, to show up in the second maybe half. Maybe this is his time and his turn. Hey, look, I bet okay. you, I, if I had to guess, he'd probably shoot 30% from the... Okay, Paul Pierce. 25% in the second the half. The last two games in Dallas... All right. Luca went one of 15 from three in games three and four. It, oh, he is due. No, no. Due. I mean, he's due to hit two. He's mm. <laughs> due. That, I, let's, let's do an over and under two and a half threes. <laughs> let's do, he's due, right? One for 15. The law of averages, right? All right. I'm giving Luca under two and a half threes for a dinner. For a dinner? For a dinner. Two okay, I'll hundred. take it. All right, two and a half. I'll take it. All right, there we go. All yeah, I, I need is three. Yeah, two, yeah. two. He got it. He's uh, one for I don't know about that yeah. one. I, he might hit three, Paul. Three. He might hit All right, three. Okay, I'm giving him two and a half. Desperation. Right. 
He might hit three, but I ain't oh, betting you maybe, are. Maybe he'll foul out, too. Maybe he'll foul out. All right. I, I got one other bet in my back pocket that All I'm right. not going to bring up because I don't want to jinx it, but you've forgotten <laughs> it, but, but I got another Hardaway. One. No. Oh, you got Hardaway as an as a, as a no, X-Factor? I don't, I don't have Hardaway as an X-Factor. Oh, but, oh, why but not? The point he had five is, threes. He had, he five, had threes. five threes all in the fourth quarter to Keyshawn's point against a bunch of guys. <laughs> I didn't know who they were. A bunch of Rick Carlisles and remember what was the guy's name? Jerry Seastein or whatever his name was. This is way before your time. It was a bunch of those guys were on the floor. But he did feel it. He did see it go through. He is, he is not Girl, your... You're not, okay, hey, wait, 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 wait. Girl, you're not about to sit over here and tell me that about Tim Hardaway Tim Jr. Tim Hardaway Jr. is not your basic, common, everyday role player. He's Ooh. not.